Honda has decided to give the Honda Pilot an overhaul, which is long overdue. This is with the recent trend of automakers giving their cars futuristic bodies and specs. Honda has been in the game for quite some time, so this won't be so hard. But somehow, what they've done with the Pilot is something to admire. Well, we don't have much information about it, but we know it will be good from the little information we do have about it. But what has Honda released about the 2023 Honda Pilot so far? Let's find out. Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today, we'll take a look at the all new 2023 Honda Pilot as we find out what little information Honda has released about it so far. Before we continue, make sure you leave a like and subscribe to our channel for nothing but the best updates on your favorite cars. And with that, let's talk about the 2023 Honda Pilot. 2023 is a year full of redesigns and remodels for the automotive industry. This is why Honda has decided to give the Pilot a new design and style. Even though Honda has yet to release the specs on the Pilot, or even photos, there have been some 2023 Pilot spy shots that have been published by Motor Authority, and it appears that the new Honda Pilot will have a boxy profile. So far, it's believed that the next generation of the Pilot will share stylistic elements with the Ridgeline pickup, which Honda also makes. So far, all we have about the 2023 Honda Pilot is a picture of a rocky mountain, with the car somewhere in the middle of it all. It's camouflaged, so to see it, you would have to squint your eyes and take a closer look. The Honda Pilot is now in its third generation, and it seems as though Honda is going for a more rugged look with this one. In fact, Honda teased the next generation 2023 Pilot Trail Sport, calling it the most rugged and capable Honda SUV ever. However, Honda has not yet released official details about it. Not only that, we don't expect a full reveal of the car until sometime later this year. Whether or not there will be a 2023 Honda Pilot release date in the fall or early winter still remains a mystery. The mid-size SUV segment has seen great growth over the years with some pretty amazing cars such as the Kia Telluride and Hyundai Palisade. With the new Honda Pilot, it could be a better alternative to these popular SUVs that have commanded hefty dealer markups. We're yet to see to what extent the new Pilot will give the other mid-size SUVs a run for their money. So far, there's been an early report that Toyota plans to introduce a larger SUV called the Grand Highlander. Ever since the Honda Pilot made its debut in 2016, it's become quite popular. It offers its riders some exceptional levels of road and seat comfort, as well as an upscale cabin design and a spacious seating arrangement. However, as the years go by, the Kia Telluride has taken over from Honda, claiming the crown as its own. This leaves Honda with no choice but to retaliate with the 2023 Honda Pilot. So far, we believe that the new Honda Pilot has moved on to a new platform. More specifically, it's believed to be moving to a framework that the recently redesigned Acura MDX has recently used. This fundamental change moves the Pilot's platform from the one it originally shared with the Odyssey minivan to the one that underpins its sportier corporate counterpart. However, there's a good side to this change. It might address one issue with the Pilot that has always been there. It's always been dull and had some pretty poor handling. Given the changes that are expected to be there, it would make total sense that the Pilot is manufactured with MDX's V6 powertrain under its hood. If this is the case, then it will have a total of 290 horsepower and 267 pound-feet of torque, which is not so bad. This V6 is a little better than the current engine on the Pilot. The current engine on the 2022 model gives the car about 280 horsepower, which is still on a V6 engine. So with the new engine, that would definitely be a better upgrade, even though it would not have that much of a difference. Regarding the transmission, we can expect the Pilot to gain an extra gear, thanks to the MDX. But then again, these are just speculations, and we have to wait and see. To have a clearer picture of what we can expect from the new Pilot, if it's going to be better, let's take a look at the 2022 model of the Pilot. The 2022 Honda Pilot gives the owner refuge. This car is for those who prefer their car to be more practical and don't really care about the minivan lifestyle. Basically, this three-row SUV cannot get the same level of roominess and versatility that the Honda Odyssey offers. This is even with the fact that they share the same platform as well as a pretty fast V6 powertrain. The only difference between the Pilot and the Odyssey is the sliding doors and third-row stretch-out space. However, 
it does try to make up for this with a higher driving position, available all-wheel drive, and the ability to tow up to about 5,000 pounds. In addition, it also has a more spacious and comfortable cabin, a host of standard driver assistance features and popular features. The only part that Honda failed with is the outward appearance, which is wholly forgettable. You'll notice this more if you compare it with some of its visually exciting rivals, such as the Kia Telluride and Hyundai Palisade. As much as the 2022 Honda Pilot is not that flashy or even fun to drive, some prefer it better than a minivan. More on the 2022 Pilot's engine. It's a V6 engine with a sporty sound and plenty of power. In addition to that, it comes with a 9-speed automatic transmission that is pretty smooth. It's not that appealing when it comes to driving it, but its considerable size can make it feel a little heavy when cornering. The upper trims come with 20-inch wheels, which, in all honesty, affect the ride quality a little bit. However, they do enhance the quirky appearance. The vehicle rides relatively smoothly when carrying people or a bunch of stuff. The Pilot does not have body control, which sometimes makes it feel a little disconnected from the road. The light steering makes it easy to maneuver at parking lot speeds, but it also is the same reason that it feels a little disconnected from the highway. Fuel economy is something that Honda has been looking at for quite some time, which makes the Pilot very efficient, even though it's quite large and very practical. According to both the EPA and a few tests, it was discovered that the front wheel drive model would achieve about 20 miles per gallon in the city and 27 miles per gallon on the highway. On the other hand, the all-wheel drive model removes about 1 mile per gallon from the former model, giving it a total of 19 miles per gallon in the city and 26 miles per gallon on the highway. The interior is one of the places that Honda really tried with the Honda Pilot. They made sure that it was spacious and practical. The beauty is that it can come with a family-friendly option, such as an in-cabin PA system. For those who prefer 8 seats, most trims come with 3 across second row. For the pricier models, they remove the bench and replace it with two captain's chairs, which reduces the passenger seats to seven. However, the third row is quite spacious and has a low seat cushion. This only makes it very practical for kids though. The dashboard has some easy to use climate controls and a clearly marked gauge cluster. There are also 16 cup holders throughout the cabin. I don't really understand why all those cup holders are there though. This SUV has a high seating position that gives the driver a commanding view of the road. It also has some big windows and thin roof pillars that don't get in the way, making the Pilot one of the best for visibility. Honda is said to maintain the same interior even with the 2023 Pilot, but we can only hope they make a few changes to improve it, such as upgrading the third row seats to be practical even for adults. Given that Honda is upgrading the platform for the Pilot, we can definitely expect it to have some better specs, but we'll just have to wait and see what they'll offer with this one. What do you think of the 2023 Honda Pilot so far? Feel free to let us know in the comment section below. Also, make sure you leave a like and subscribe to our channel for more amazing updates on your favorite cars. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.